suboptimal yeah, on their started, opening drive. Yeah. This snap went awry. Yeah, it started with a terrible snap, and then Toledo capitalized with the touchdown to Kobach, and then uh, just a poorly thrown ball by McDonald gets picked off. And then Eli Peters with a nice throw, and bang, bang, there you go. Toledo is back in the groove early. Who led Mac tight ends in receptions last year. They put some window dressing on this play, and it's their biggest play of the night so far on the handoff to Claire as they get a first down out to the 39-yard line, a pickup of 13. It might right up the gut, and that was a good run. They were seeing kind of the same thing, downhill run right between the A-gaps. And as the Falcons get into Toledo territory for the first time, McDonald on the rollout. A wide open target. Ball comes loose at the end of the play. The Rockets appear to have pounced on it. Tyrone Broden crossing, brought it in. Ball is loose. And it's a celebration for the Rockets. Five. And off to the inside, Shakif Seymour gets his second carry of the day. That's good for about a dozen. 20 to seven victory. One of the biggest upsets of the college football season. That was like the Red Sea parting on that run for Seymour, who had all sorts of room. Terrace, a huge component of this line, injured right before the start of the season last year. Seymour, slippery out of the first tackle and nearly eluded a second grasp. He's on a roll himself on this drive. Gains of 12, 15, and 12 more. And now here's Peters on third down. The pocket's clean. A fastball over the middle. It's caught. And a first down. Still going. Bryce Mitchell, the senior from right here in Toledo, gets them inside the red zone. The native of Jacksonville with another strike and another touchdown. All Jawan Newton had to do was pivot and turn to the end zone for an 18-yard hookup. Touchdown number one. Design rollout. Who's open? Peters still looks to the front corner of the end zone. And the two-point conversion is good to Bryce Mitchell, who was tucked in like a child at bedtime right in front of the pile. Ah. Scoring there. Get an open guy. McDonald withstands pressure, but the floater Falls too short looking for Ortega Jones and the stunt on the line got to the quarterback, but the starts and kind of sent him in a spiral a bit. Jason Candle said he got hurt just doing drills on his high school yeah, field. In a 21 nothing game. Pressure is on. McDonald lost it. There's a lot of contact there, but no flag. As Presley boats the tight end, goes to the ground. Another fourth down. Peters back to pass, pressure comes, and Peters is sacked. Pursued from the jump, and he goes down from the backside. A couple weeks, maybe a couple weeks away, that's always a good one. McDonald hit as he throws, and it's intercepted. Every time something has started to go right for Bowling Green tonight, it quickly evaporates into trouble. I mean, Matt McDonald just hit as he threw, didn't, didn't have a shot. That's on the slant, Maddox, and he's got the first down. That's Saw the linebacker come and threw the football. He got the snap before the defense was even ready. He's got plenty of room to run, and he's got the first down and then some. It's the corners playoff, and Peters goes up the middle. He's got plenty of running room, only white jerseys behind him. Ball is struck loose at the end of the play, and possession belongs to Bowling Green. On the high snap, the blitz comes. McDonald unleashes, and the ball is incomplete as he was eyeing Morris, the tight end. Four-man rush, pressure does not get there, and an extra effort on a slip tackle. It's a first down for Newton and the Rockets. In Mac country, you know that spring football <laughs> is not exactly a palatable thing for fans. Kobach across the middle, a huge pickup on the pass to the running back. And he is in the Bowling Green territory. Defense showed pressure, then backed off. And they drop seven. Peters gets flushed. And with a stretch at the end there, he is eked out a first down. 
So they lost a yard. They crank up the pressure on the crossing route. They've got the catch. They've got the first down. Mitchell's still going, and Mitchell is into the end zone. 42-yard touchdown. He's in the back 12 north. After the Toledo touchdown, this is wide open running room for McDonald. One of the biggest plays of the day for Bowling Green. <laughs> Looking for their first score of the night. Oh, here we go. McDonald loads up, fires downfield, passes caught at the three yard line. Can the Falcons knock it in? They put McDonald on the move, and his throw to the back of the end zone is way too high. He was getting pressured as he rolled, and now it's fourth and goal. They don't have enough time. Call it. Well, the snap was recovered, and the kick. Call a timeout. Don't force him. He had the, the clunker game, Mike. He's had some, okay, some bad plays here and there, but boy, he's been so good as a rookie. With First and ten for the Rockets. That's a first down and then some on the give to Kobach. He's is that just genetic quickness that you yes. can't do anything about yes. us? From God himself. Back to back first down runs for Kobach. Vacations. I don't think they're going to blitz here. Have you heard him last time? They brought seven on that last drive. This time they just bring four and they get the stop that they wanted. Could have been a few yards shorter of the sticks. <laughs> On fourth and one. The initial spot looks short for Seymour. It was Jerry Roberts did a good job of getting in the backfield and stopping that run. And it's a turnover on downs. So he's had to wait quite a while just to get to this moment. Ball is batted at the line and blown dead on that third and 11. How much do you think a coach can or should be we go? It's the best way to do it. A lot of room for Shaquif Seymour. And he just runs right on through. Seymour, right side. Untouched. Touchdown. Handoff on second down and a good burst. Gets them a first down. Out to the 45-yard line. Living in Michigan and Ohio, they can drive those games a little easier for those guys. On the rollout, crossing pattern that's worked so well tonight for Toledo. Third and 15, almost picked off mm. again on the swing pass. The first-time starter loads up, throws into a tight window downfield, incomplete. And the drive ends on the try to Ortega Jones. And a field goal is all they have yielded against Bowling Green. We're going to see some new faces here now. And another team in that boat has been FIU out of Conference USA. Yeah, I believe. Juan Finn comes in and he hands off to Jacquez Stewart. Explodes up the middle and inside the 20. So starter, but you bring in Daquan Finn for a couple plays. That's tough on a defense. His long strides <laughs> take him to the outside, <laughs> and he gets the first down. Finn, another handoff and another solid tackle up the middle. Philosophy and, and one that works. Clucky on for the kick. It's good with 